Oh no, there's a toilet monster. Wait, 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 wait. Can I flush it? 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 Oh no, 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 no. She's gonna get sucked up in. No! Oh God! Oh! It's And welcome to GT Not Live, where things are about to get spooky. That's right, we finally had a chance to decorate for Halloween. We got our festive Halloween pillows, which you know is legit Halloween decorations, plus some spooky webbing and some spooky pumpkins and the eyeballs that are just going to be watching us this entire time. They don't blink. They always keep staring. The eyes. The walls have eyes. That would have been scary if I had gotten it right the first time, but I didn't get it right the first time. So anyway, the walls have eyes. Pretend like I said it right the first time and uh, now pretend to be scared. Matt, do you dress up for Halloween? Uh, yeah. Yeah? Do people not? Uh, yeah, you're, you're old now. Oh, no. Old absolutely. people tend not to or is you, less likely. You dress up. I do, yeah. yes. I've been privy to your dressing up. Indeed, mm -hmm. yes. Uh, so do you have your costume in no, mind for this year? I don't. It's kind of, you're kind of close. We, uh, yeah. As we record this, this is what, October 11th, 12th, yeah. something like that? So you're just giving away all of our secrets. I'm giving away our secrets, okay. yes. I'm going to be gone in Los Angeles next week, so we have to film some of these early. That's why. Um, so, yeah, I'm, I'm coming out to work on St. Jude stuff, have a bunch of meetings, uh, and just, like, also my family's coming out with us because it's their vacation. So it's going to be, like, a big family get-together in Los Angeles, but also a lot of work involved. So that's why... Thank you, Matt, for making me justify having to shoot this stuff early. That's also, to anyone who wonders, like, why we don't do these live anymore, it's just harder with Ollie's schedule and a lot of the travel and stuff. It's it's easier to be able to batch a couple of these for when we're doing travel, things like that. At some point, we'll do live stuff again, and obviously we have St. Jude, which is big and live, but that's the reason. So now that I've digressed all of that, and now yeah. that we're all on the same page, Matt. Yes. What do you, you're, so you do not know, you're kind well, of procrastinating. So I know that we're, we're doing a group costume. Oh, okay. And there's okay. four Fun. of us. Nice. I think so you're going to dress as different members of the fire, the fire, earth, water, and oh, air nations? Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. See, that's why I brought it up, because I was like, surely Matt will have an idea. Uh, boom. I okay. think it would be funny if all of us were the Joker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's great. Different iterations of the Joker? <laughs> no, we're all the Heath Ledger Joker. <laughs> oh, that's less fun. I think it'd be I, I, That's That's just like, oh, uh, we don't have any creative ideas. <laughs> like, if you were different iterations of the that would be cool. No. If you roll out as, a, as team, and one of you is the Joker from Joker. One of you is the gangster mm. Joker from Suicide Squad. One of you is, is Joker. I realize my mistake. Uh, we would all be the Joaquin Phoenix Joker. The Joker See, Joker. You don't even know what Joker yeah. you are. You call yourself a Joker fan? Get out. Never called myself that. No, but I, I don't know. If, if you're dressing like him, know who you are. Okay, so you're going to be Joaquin Phoenix as yeah. Joker. Okay. But if you have any, I mean, the uh, Avatar idea is, is a much Avatar, better idea. Avatar. I, I love the four generations of Joker, though. I, I think that's brilliant. Well. What do you mean, well? I'll workshop it. What do you mean you'll work? <laughs> it was a gr the, the chat is going to agree with me so much. You guys down in the comments. Tell me how good of an idea that was. Because both, I mean, Air Na the, the Avatar Nations yep. and those are two solid ideas. Well, so for background, we're going to a show and the vibes are going to be like trolly. Okay. So think of like a troll costume. Okay. Like the stupid. So so costume. you are you you will have a gemstone in your belly that I can rub and make wishes on? Oh, not literally the troll. You're going to dress like Poppy and a Justin Timberlake? Was Poppy in a Justin Timberlake video? No, not Poppy. Poppy is the name of the main troll in the Trolls movie, and Justin Timberlake was the troll. <laughs> Don't worry about it. It's, I thought you were it, And I, I'm just, I'm just playing along. With, yes, okay. So you, you can. What if you have a giant troll face, like the the Rage comics? Maybe the meme. Okay. Troll face. Yeah. Okay. I would Trolls. like. Yeah. Sure. Uh huh. We'll keep. We'll keep working. You on can it. dress as troll guy. Yeah. Old. We could all Old Rick reference. Astley. You could. Uh huh. That's trolly. You can do trolling through that generations. Okay. Do you have a costume idea for this year? <laughs> Matt's like, please, please stop talking to me about this. So, look at all these great ideas that are just being hurled at you over here for free. This is these are all this is free content for you. 
Um, no, so for us, because we have a three-year-old now, I mean, because of Ollie, all of our costumes are kind of like family-themed for the right. foreseeable future. Mm -hmm. And this year we've gone through roughly three different ones. So uh, last year we dressed as Abba, but we kind of tweaked it to be 80s hairband because Abba didn't really have fun outfits. And yep. But that was Ollie. Ollie wanted to be Abba really badly. This year Ollie started and for months said he wanted to be a sports car. Not a driver, not anything. He wanted to be a sports car, and specifically the Koenigsegg, uh, which is a very expensive sports car. They only make 15 of them in the world. He saw one in a, a sports car, because I got him a sports car book from the library. He saw it in the, you know, it's like the McLaren, the Bugatti Veyron. It was just like, look at these cool, interesting sports cars. And one of them is this uh, Koenigsegg, which has this cool feature where, like, the doors, like, fold up and kind of do, like, yoga. And I'm like, oh, it looks like the car's doing yoga. Mm -hmm. And he thought that was so funny. He thought it was so cool. And so he's like, the Koenigsegg. Um, so for months, he's wanted to be this car that's able to, like, fold up on itself. Very complicated. And Steph and I are like, ah, how do we do that? Uh, but then the other day, he switched to Gibble, the Pokemon. And this is it. Uh, why? Great question. Uh... <laughs> He knows, like, two Pokemon. He knows Pikachu and Gibble just because I, I think he stumbled across a GIF of one one day. And, you know, like, Google searching. Oh, you know what it was? Okay, the weirdest connection here. Uh, we have a, dr like, w since he was born, we've been, like, playing with dreidels and educating him about, like, different holiday traditions and this and that. And so one of the things that you can land on on a dreidel is Gimmel. Uh, which is where you win it all. If, it, if your dreidel lands on Gimmel, you win all the coins in the pot, right? So, g one day he was looking on Google for Gimmel, the uh, letter of the Semitic abjats. Uh, <laughs> but instead, the, the Google thought that he said Gibble, which then gave him images of this cute little Pokemon with a big mouth. And he's like, what is this? And this is so adorable. And then he started to see a gif of Gibble where, like, Gibble has this big mouth and munches on things. And he thought it was really cute. There's a gif of a uh, three-dimensional Gibble that spins around. And he thought that was awesome. So that's how he got hooked on Gibble. As the old, he's never seen Pokemon ever. He, he learned about Pokemon through dreidels, right? Uh, <laughs> weirdest, weirdest way to learn this stuff. Uh, so now he's hooked on Gibble. But Gibble is also a really hard costume to achieve because there are no Gibble outfits and he's got this big mouth. And so we'd have to kind of like concoct that from scratch. So we're like, okay, so we bought a bunch of fabric this weekend. But now Steph and I have this other idea, which I think is the best of all worlds because it taps into something that he loves and is also something that is easier to make and I think we can accomplish better, which is water towers. Ali loves water towers and yeah. not just water. He loves water towers tipping over and like he will build every morning. He wakes up and goes to his magnet tiles and he'll build different iterations of towers, tip them over, rewind them tipping over. Watch this one tip over. Watch this one re reverse over hours. Endless entertainment for him right now. And we're like, do you want to be a water tower for Halloween? And so we'll see. So he's either going to be a Koenigsegg, a Gibble or a water tower. That and, and we, uh, of course, will be the accompanying. Uh, Stephanie will be Ash Ketchum, and I will be maybe some other Pokemon if he goes with Gibble. Okay. And maybe I'll be a giant Pokeball. Um, or if he goes with Water Tower, we will be maybe like a Water Tower Engineer or two other versions of long, tall, cylindrical uh, industrial buildings, like a farm silo and uh, uh, a nuclear exhaust tower. I like that all I asked you was, what's your Halloween costume going to be? And and this is what came out. That's what it is. I mean, it's this is it. We've been th This has been months in the making, Matt. You, you didn't know what Pandora's box you unlocked when you asked that question. Truly, there were like five layers to, so to many, that idea. So many layers. It, <laughs> I'm just still, I've been wondering for a while, like, where did the Gibble thing start again? It's like, oh, yeah, this is it. Yeah. It's weird, man. So anyway, our and I've tried to introduce him to other Pokemon. He's not interested. He's just like, Gibble! He's funny. Uh, so anyway, hey, we're playing House. It's a spooky Halloween game. We started playing it the other week. It's really fun. Uh, basically, there is a, a sequence. It, what we realized is that there's a sequence of events that we have to do fairly quickly in order to prevent ourselves and maybe our family from dying. Uh, you know, we have to prevent our sister from getting crushed by a chandelier. We have to prevent our mom from slipping and dying uh, on, a, on a patch of water in the kitchen. 
and at some point everyone turns into monsters and starts slaughtering us. This game is really creepy, really disturbing for an 8-bit eight, eight title, so I'm excited to do this. It was really fun. It seems like a big puzzle game, um, so we're going to do that right now. We've talked about all this other stuff enough. Let's just hop into it. Okay, so when last we left off, we knew... We figured out that we have to put a bucket to save mom. We learned that we have to... So there's the bucket that saves mom. Uh, there is the dead body in the basement. I've fallen out of rhythm with all this, so forgive me. Um, we know there's a key under the cat. Can I... We know that... Ooh. That's new. We didn't have this last time. We did. Did we? Yeah, towards the end we found it. Was it at the very end? Yeah. Okay. Thank you for reminding me. Mm -hmm. I was I, I was trying to destroy because we got to figure out a way to save our sister from the piano. Oh hey, hey kitty. And the bucket is in the room with oh the milk. That's right. So we use the milk to lure the kitty. I'm I'm warming back up into this. All right, Tam. Does tab not work? Why is tab not working? Tab! Nope, don't want that. Tab, why is it tab? Hold up, sorry. Why doesn't it hold? Didn't it say tab to cycle through the items? Q! Apparently it's Q. <laughs> not tab, because why not? Okay. So we need, we need, if we have any hope of saving mom, we gotta get the bucket over to there right now. So let's unlock, let's grab the bucket. Okay, my sister's definitely gonna die because I have not figured out a way to save her yet, but we can. There we go, that's sucking up water, perfect. My sister's about to die a horrific and terrible death. I st I'm still convinced there's something up there up, uh, up on that shelf that we need. I just don't know. We have that slingshot that we can get through here. Swing, swing, swing. Hey, sandwiches! Nice. Perfect, so mom's doing okay. Come and eat. Okay, there's the evil, evil creature. Okay, well, we're... So we did not do that fast enough, unless there is a way to stop her. Is there a way to wake up the cat earlier? Yes. Uh, did we figure that out or are you just saying? No, we did. Oh, uh, you dropped the ball. It's the bowling ball. That's right. Yes, that's right. I'm Okay, there we go. Perfect. It is. You're right. It is the bowling ball. I do remember. Perfect. Yeah, okay. So we use the bowling ball to wake her up. And then that allows us to get the key earlier, which then sets everything in motion. So you really don't actually need... Ooh! That was new! Hey, kitty. Weird. Oh, okay, then we use the milk to lure her away. Okay. Open. Open. Okay, great. I've already got it, I guess. Milk. Oh, no! <laughs> oh, no! I'm trapped in the milk! <laughs> I didn't know you could slip on the milk. That's actually really funny. Unlock. Bucket. I wonder if I could do both of those in the same loop rather than doing this back and forth. Probably, right? I just don't want Mom to get... Okay, that's that's landing in the right spot. Mom is going to be safe. So she's all good there. Can I drop... Okay, that doesn't do anything here. Okay, here comes our good friend, the rat. The ratoncito. Okay, good. Nice! Look at me shucking and jiving like a pro. Okay, so now... Up here. Swing, swing, swing. Turn on light. We don't want that. Where's my bowling ball? Drop it here. Nice. We're down here. Pick up my bowling ball. We need to chop off his arm. We got our friend here. So now we have the slingshot, yeah? What can we do with the slingshot? This is... Not there. Anything behind this? Nope. 
okay. And we have the gun is the other thing. I remember. Okay, so now we're done with this room, at least for now. Let's go back to... Let me think about this. Okay. Okay. <laughs> right before the bite. Right before. Come and eat. Hopefully. Haha, -ha, take that. Oh! Oh! Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. What about this? What about this? What about this? What about this? Ha <laughs> <laughs> Don't know what I expected. <laughs> You know, so in my de in my defense, I I think it you know it, it kind of made sense. We just have to do that faster before she gets there, right? That way it crashes the piano before she gets into the room. I think that's the strategy here. And now, can I do this? Okay, come on. Oh. <gasps> Hey, bud, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I feel bad about that. I feel bad about that. I feel bad about that. But here, I, I need you down so that we can try this, maybe? Hey! Do I... What is this thing? Okay, so it's only this. Can I kill the rat? Should I kill the rat? I don't really want to kill the rat. I feel bad about him. Oh, and he's back. And he's Okay, and there's Evil Cat. There's Evil Cat. Please don't kill me, Evil Cat. This room is locked. Is it on fire? I'm confused. Ooh, hello. Hi. Hi, Spooky. I can pick up my sandwich. Okay. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, leave me alone. Leave me alone, Shadow. Okay, leave me alone, Shadow. Okay. Okay, you're gone. What else? You, you should talk to the window person. I should talk to the creepy person in the window? Yeah. Yeah? Should I? No, I think you should. Really? Yeah. Okay. Oh, God! Are you kidding me? Why? I was just peeping a little. I smelled blood and thought something might be wrong. There's always something interesting going on here. And you seem to be in a predicament. Your sister is pure of heart. The house has her in its icy grip. She can't fight back. You must guide her to safety. I, I'm, you don't have to tell, hey, weird long neck creature. You don't have to tell me that, I'm, I'm trying. Not my fault that I accidentally killed her, to be fair. Okay, maybe it was my fault because I shot a slingshot at a chandelier hovering above her head. So that was totally my fault. Okay, I gotta guide her to safety. Hop to it. It's very important that you cleanse this curse. Hop to it, okay. Okay, cool. Hey, so creepy. Okay, Daddy is home. We don't like Daddy. Daddy kills us. So I'm gonna shotgun Daddy. We're just gonna wait here for Daddy. Okay, here's Daddy. Shotgun. Okay! Oh! Uh, uh, okay! Oh my- Oh, jeez. Okay, so we learned that was okay. That was very informative. We learned a lot from that round uh, We learned that the long neck woman who I've been scared of that entire time is actually a friendly so that's good to know Yeah, uh, we learned that apparently the shotgun and daddy seem to Fit with it like if puzzle pieces fit together. It seems like shotgun plus daddy equals kind of a win So I'm either missing a third shotgun shell or or I need to use something else to attack him, but it seemed like he wasn't going to let me get close because he spit out that, like, acid blood. What else? And we learned that we can hit the chandelier, but that we need to hit the chandelier earlier so that way our sister survives. Like, she doesn't start her piano lesson, so she survives. So, I, so we're making progress, right? Is there anything else I missed, Matt? That seems pretty accurate. That seems right. Right? Okay, let's try it again. This is great. I love this game. This is so fun. By the way, I forgot to mention this. Uh, if you're into creepy stuff, our Halloween merch, 
right below this episode, um, right below this video in the little merch shelf that YouTube wants you to use so that way they can start paving the way for consumerism on the platform. That's, I don't think that's a, a kept secret at all. You know, everyone wants to be the place where you buy all your stuff so that way they can advertise to you and buy it in the same place. Uh, so anyway, the, and the merch shelf is very clearly their first step in that direction. That is just where the, all the platforms are going. Instagram beat them to the punch, and so they're mad about it, so now they're trying to do it. Anyway, you can support our consumerist dreams uh, by checking out our our new merch. It's a, a cool collaboration with an artist named Chagovinia. Her work is really awesome, so we work with her on these designs. And if you're interested in either the hoodie or the t-shirt, that's right below. The hoodie, uh, the t-shirt actually slightly glows. So as we transition between rounds of the game, that is available to you. Uh, and it's quite tight. So if you don't have a Halloween costume, or your Halloween costume isn't quite turning out well, uh, you know, you can dress as a theorist for Halloween. You're welcome, Matt. Are you saying my costume isn't going to work out well? I'm just saying, uh, you know, how many, how many Joaquin Phoenixes do you really need? I don't think you have a lot of faith in me. I can't wait to see it. Honestly, I can't wait to see it, Matt. Okay. I, actually, I want to see, <laughs> next time, will you bring in some other pictures of... Of, of you and me. Yeah, I'd love to see you in yeah, your past Halloween outfits. I, do that. I love seeing other people's Halloween outfits. My my favorite, well, yeah, I guess my favorite Halloween outfit. Yeah. Uh, three years in a row, uh -huh. from eight to ten, uh -huh. uh, we cut out from cardboard, like a giant red magnet. Okay. Glued little rubber ducks to it. You were a, a chick magnet? Yeah. I like that you were a duck. <laughs> you were a duck magnet? Uh, it took some explaining. That's but, cute. Uh, I like that. Yeah, if you get an eight year old and you throw a heteronormative uh, uh, beliefs onto them, they get a lot of candy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's cute. It works every time. Uh, that's really funny. One of my favorites uh, that someone did creative, of, like in, when it comes to like really creative outfits, someone uh, dressed up in all yellow and black and then uh, gave themselves uh, a black eye and uh, boxing gloves. And she was dressed as a, a black-eyed Susan. Oh, that's good. Uh, which I thought was really good. There, I was a black-eyed Pete one year. Oh, oh black-eyed Pete, that's a good one. We were all about little pun outfits. Yeah, pun out I, I think pun outfits are like They're top really tier costumes, uh, honestly. The best costume, least effort pun costume uh -huh. is a quarterback. You simply tape a quarter to your back. To your back. Wow. Wow. That was, that was like when that's, you're. That is that is least effort. You're you're. That's when you're in like the seventh grade and you're like way too old to be trick or treating. <laughs> but you're like I'm still gonna do this for free candy. Yeah. Okay, so this is good. I think we're in a good place right now. Uh, we need to drop this guy. Okay, so I need this for my friend, the rat. Ooh, 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 she's gonna find out. Okay, I wanna talk to her. I hate what I, wait, I hate mornings. I hate myself. I hate my life. Okay, she's, she's struggling a little bit. Okay, life is meaningless. Oh no! You did this, didn't you? Get away from me. Oh no! No, I have nothing. Oh no, oh, this, oh. Hey, but at least you're not dead, you know? That's, that's a win, maybe. Right? That, that's that's a victory in and of itself. Kind of. So we got two. Oh, okay, she's leaving. Where are you going? Where are you going, girl? What are you up to now? What are you up to? Sandwiches. Sandwiches are ready. Do you want a sandwich? That's T Toby's. I'll never forgive father for what he did. That's Toby's. I'll never forgive father for what he did. So I have Toby's slingshot. Okay. Oh no! There's a toilet monster! Wait, 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 wait. Can I flush it? 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 Oh no, 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 no! No! She's gonna get sucked up in. No! Oh god! Oh! So you want to flush the floater. Uh, <laughs> geez. Oh no! Oh no! 
<laughs> well, now I'm really curious too about what what did our family do to Toby? And is Toby like a brother? What? Okay, flush down the toilet. So hopefully she is safe on the potty now. Um, but hey, we're learning what her path is post post piano death because at this point we've never actually gotten past that really. Uh, so that's exciting. So now here, here. Uh, got milk jug. Boop milk. Here. So now we've got door. Let's see if I can do both of these at the same time, because that would actually save me a little bit. Pick up here. Okay, so now we move around. Great, so now we can save mom. By getting up here. Oh man, we're getting good at this. I'm feeling good. Drip, okay, good. I'm making progress. Hey mom, don't mind me with this ax. Don't, don't worry about what's going on over here. Just, just ignore it. Okay, there. Bowling ball. Where could the last shotgun shell be? What happened to Toby? What did our family do to poor Toby? I'm very concerned about that one. All right, there's this evil, evil shadow going there. Let's let's ruin my sister's hopes and dreams. Hey, then. hold up, hold up. What, is, what are you? Hold up, what are you? Why is there a snail this time? A little girl and an adorable one at that. My name is Marty. I'm a, I'm a snail. You smell like you're having a hard time. Hey, Marty, Marty. Let's simmer down here for a second, okay, Marty? Let's let's. Let's just slow our roll here a little bit. I am not having a hard time. I'm just figuring stuff out. I think we're doing a great job. Would you like some help? No, I don't trust you. Get out of here, Marty. I don't, I don't need you and your judgmental mollusk self. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh no. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Can I get the water bucket? Is that gonna kill mom now? Okay, hey. Okay, great, that didn't work at all. Uh, <laughs> shoot! Well, that's a problem we're probably gonna have to deal with at some point. Uh, just when you thought the house was safe. Don't mind me and my shotgun. Hey, hi, bye. Okay. Uh, no, get out of here. Okay, hey, sandwiches. Delicious. I really don't... I feel like... Shoot. Shoot, there we go. There we go. I really feel like... Killing the rat is a bad idea. I don't know why. I just get a sense... Okay, okay. Ah, uh, shoot. Okay, oh. Poop. Okay. Woo! Getting around ya. Are you alive still? No! Shit! Shit, she's gone, she's gone. Okay. Okay, she's gone. What else? What else can I do? Can I break this? Shoot. So, the toilet... Flushing the toilet wasn't enough. Okay, that didn't work. That doesn't work. Just curious what else I can do here, since since at this point my sister's already gone. Um, let's see if there's anything with all these things. Okay, that's moving too fast. Before I had, so last episode, I had the theory that the bowling ball would stop the carpet. I think we try it here. Oh! <gasps> Worked! Yes! Okay. Okay, so let's check on mom or like the long neck person then. Just to get more information. Because at this point, it feels like we're... Okay, nothing through here. Hey, long neck person. Oh, shoot. Oh. Oh, yeah! Get dunked down, evil spirit! Uh, why do I need a sandwich? What is the sandwich for? I haven't figured out a use of the sandwich. Here, I'm gonna to talk to you. Seems you're under the curse of this house. I've seen dozens of families move in. None of them were as cute as you. You're a strong little girl. I'm sure you'll find a way to get out. It's a shame about your sister. She's been a bit depressed. 
She needs her big sister now more than ever. Keep an eye on her. Make her feel safe. Protect her. I destroyed the thing that she loves most, which is the piano. Does that count as making her feel safe? Uh, I tried to flush down the toilet monster, but that one didn't work. Hey! So this is gone. Daddy's home. Okay, so... I love that this music is basically the music from... The music from Earthbound. Okay, one, two... Shoot, I lost it. Shoot. No! Oh! Ooh! Oh, no! Oh, it's a little welcome home kiss! It's the nicest welcome home kiss you could ever ask for. Okay, so there's definitely a delay between times that you're allowed to shoot him. And uh, Daddy bites with his teeth. Uh, Daddy's kisses are not good kisses, so good to know. Just so if you'll remember away. from our last playthrough, yeah. I believe the sandwich is poison. Right? No, that's what I thought, yeah. So, but I'm not sure what can eat. That's kind of one of my questions, yeah. too. Because the sandwich seems like one of the things that we haven't figured out what to do with yet. Um, so we still got to figure out what to do with the sandwich. It feels like there should be like one more item in that basement area for some reason. And we got to put out the fire. And I think we're... I think it's we got to put out the fire sooner is the only thing. Like, I think we almost had it that time. It was just, as soon as we dropped the land, the, the chandelier, I think it's that's when we put out the fire. Do you think we should get help from the snail? No. Not yet. Okay. Not yet. I think we give it a little bit more time. Okay, there's that. So now we've got our axe. Axe goes to, hey mom, don't mind me. I'm just gonna undo all the work that you just did, hiding up the secrets of our family. Go, go, go. Okay, we need this. Here. There. Pick this up again. Axe, cut. It feels like there's something behind that wall. That wall with the peeling paint back there, that feels very suspicious to me. Just saying. Okay, so now we're to slingshot. Okay, Kitty's doing great. Okay, we're gonna... Oh, okay, we're gonna shoot. Go, 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 go. Oh, come on. Okay, that's there. There. I don't trust you, snail. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe maybe he'll be a good guy. We'll, we'll see. Hey, sister. What are we going to do with sister? Do we need to... Let's grab the water now before it gets to be too big of a fire. Yes! Okay. Good. 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 So now that shouldn't catch on fire. Which, I guess, prevents a problem for us. Uh, Mom's not going to trip over there. So now she's going to the toilet. So, bef so before she gets to the toilet, can we break it with the axe? Since we can break other things with the axe, should we break the toilet? <gasps> Is that going to work? Is that going to work? Is that going to work? Here, let's see. Let's see. Hey. Hey. Hey, don't, no, don't sit on that. Don't sit on that. No, that would, that would hurt. I hate that axe. I hate these walls. I mean, I'm, I'm not a big fan of them, too, at this point, honestly. I hate frogs. I hate myself. Okay. Hey. I hate my life. Oh, no! No, 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 <gasps> okay, leave, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Okay, that's fine. I, I, this, shoot. Okay, we learned last time, though, that we can, uh, destroy the, the, the bench. Yep. The, the chair that she was that's... on. Okay, so as I go to destroy the toilet, I also have to destroy the bench. She is so determined, Matt. She is determined to make my life miserable. <laughs> What the heck? We need... Can I just give her a hug? Talk about it a little bit? You know, recommend a local therapist? You know, maybe some family intervention time? Something? Something other than this elaborate convoluted series of events that were going on? Unlock. 
Okay, pick up. Here we go, and we're spinning around, great. Okay, so we've got ourselves the axe. Got our bowling ball, here we go. Boop. Collect the water, great, axe. Hey mom, don't mind me. Oh wow, I'm, I'm, I'm booking it this time. Please get out of the way, thank you. Making good time, making good time here, guys. All right, here, Toby, thanks so much for your generous support of today's stream. Thank you. You're the best. Over here. Where's the last shotgun shell? That's one of the big lingering questions as far as I'm concerned. Because right now, I don't know where it is. And I'm a little bit worried that I'm going to need it for daddy. And we just don't know where it is yet, which ain't great. Okay. Good. Got that one. Oh, wait, wait for my stamina to get back. I'll drop this. Great. Hit this. Shotgun shell. Uh, I need this. Okay, so she's going to have a minute to mourn the loss of her thing. Oh! No! You were such a good run! I hope I tasted terribly! I hope you choke on my skull! Stupid rat. Jerk. That was such a good run! Oh, we knew exactly what we were doing. Oh, that was so good. Do you think he would choke on my skull? Skull is a big thing to consume. He's a big rat. He is a big rat. Can Rats can eat bones, right? I think so. Do you know hyenas can eat bones? I do. Do you know that hyenas subsist mostly off bones? I don't know. I didn't know that they subsisted mostly off bones. I, I might have made that up. <laughs> are you? But I know that they, they like, bones are like a part of their diet. Oh yeah, no, I, I, I agree with that. That makes sense to me. That freaks me out. Yeah. I would agree. That... I don't think a mammal should be. That was dumb. I, I, missed, I misused my stamina. I was distracted by hyena bones. Yeah. I, I'm, 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 I'm sustaining the rat, you know? <laughs> the hyena bones got me all in a tizzy right now. <laughs> Um, so you know. Yes. I'm reading a playthrough currently. And I'm doing great, and you're, right? Well, you are actually doing really well. Thank you. Um, I like how surprised you sound about that. <laughs> you're like, this is so unusual so for the your, stream. Your reputation uh, precedes, me. precedes me. Thank you. But should you need help, I, uh, I and the snail are here. I was going to say, wait. should I talk to the snail? It seems like the snail might not be malicious. I actually haven't read anything about the snail. Okay. I just want to talk to him. You just want- well, I did talk to him, and he's like, you want help? Well, I want to talk more to him. You want to talk more to him? Are you- are you alluding- do you know something that I don't? No, genuinely I don't. Okay, well- I just- if I were playing the game, first thing i do is talk to the snail. I mean, the snail is- uh, trust me, I'm a big fan of mollusks. Of all types. Are snails mollusks? Yeah. Huh. Of course. Are slugs? Uh, are slugs mollusks? That's a- that's a better question, because I don't- Are slugs snails? No, no, really? those are, those are slugs and snails are two different things. <laughs> just, I always, <laughs> you always thought that. Th I thought snails were slugs with shells. Yeah, I mean you're not wrong from a like biological. I mean they're pretty darn close to each other. But, but like a snail isn't just a slug wearing a shell. No, that isn't. I, I mean in the Pokemon world you have Pokemon that kind of function that way. You know there's there's I think like Slugma or whatever who transforms into. You know, a different Pokemon based on the fact that he's wearing a, a shell or not. Okay. Hello again. You look like you could use my help. Sure. Pick him up. What did you do? Cute. Oh my gosh. This is really adorable, <laughs> actually. Okay. This is legitimately cute. But I'm also afraid... Oh, he makes me faster. Whoa. Oh, he makes me so much faster. Okay. Okay. Nope. Nope. Come on. Get get stuck. Okay. Ooh, that was close. Oh, and he gives me uh, so much more stamina. This is great. He's gonna totally eat my brain. No. You do know this, right? No, you doubted him, and he is proving you wrong. I'm telling you, he's gonna eat my brain. Why oh, should have done this the first time? Oh, mommy's gonna die. I I lost track of what I'm supposed to be doing. Shoot, shoot. Oh no. Oh no, mom. Oh, mom's dead. Mom didn't die. Yes. Okay. D -d -d Loophole there. Okay. Watch out here. Uh, we need this. Break this. Seconds before she gets in. And break this. So now, everyone is alive. Right? I'm gonna put this here just so it doesn't bother me. I hate snails more than I hate father. Oh, 
cute. Oh, look, and even my picture has a snail on it now. Okay, snail. Yeah. Win. Thank you. Good call. Even if, here's the thing. Even if at the end of this, it's like, you weren't, weren't supposed to take the snail and he's going to eat your brains. Which wouldn't surprise me for this game. Even if that's the case, it was an experiment well worth it. Because, look, I'd rather have my brains eaten and wear a snail as a hat than not have a snail as a hat. If someone's going to eat your brains. Snail. It's the snail. Snail, snail. Did he have a name? I feel like he did. It was. It was remember. Marty? Morty? I, maybe. It started with an M, didn't it? I, immediately I thought Gary, but then I was like, that's just that's, not right. Yeah, that's not it. You're, you're just thinking Spongebob. I feel yeah. so alone. I feel so alone. Okay. Should we tell our mother about this? Because I feel like mother would benefit from that. Hi. Have you always been there? No. You, so you need that disgusting... Disgusting snail's help! Pathetic. Okay. Will you hold me? The sna if the snail is a good guy, the doll seems to be diametrically opposed, but sure. Here. Here. Hello. Here. Thanks for bringing her to me, Tabby. I missed you, Dolly. Don't ever leave me again. Okay! That seems positive, I guess. She seems happy about that. Hello. So we, now we need, we need, no. Okay, nothing in there. We need another shotgun shell, cause daddy's coming. And he's the last, like, so she's, as long as she doesn't move from her bed, she's alive-ish. We still have this. Hey, how'd I do? Is she alive? The house feeds on your family's pain. Don't let it get the best of you. Only you can stop this. We're different from the others. We can remember. When it resets, they forget. Use this to your advantage. There must be a way to stop these freak accidents. I, <laughs> what do you think I'm doing? Check every room. Wouldn't want to miss anything. Sometimes the answer you need is not in plain sight. Okay. Okay. Oh, oh. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, wait, wait, wait. Can I do this? Can I do that? Is that a thing? Oh, Jesus! Okay, oh, 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 oh my. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Okay. Do I need- to Okay, okay! Hi! Hello! Nope. Nope. I- 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 I kind of want to use my shotgun on you, but... Also- Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. I think you should shoot him. I think so, too. Here, let- let- if- If she comes in here. I'm right. Okay. Okay. Nope. Shoot. Okay, that's two. Oh my gosh, there's a rubber ducky! I... There's a rubber ducky. We found a rubber ducky. You're so close to this one ending, and I want to tell you how to do it so bad. Don't. Okay. <laughs> Don't tell me. Do I have everything I need? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yes. You've done, yeah. Okay. Uh, I, am I missing a third shotgun shell? No. Okay. Okay. Does it have to do with me killing dad? Um, yes. Okay. Um, God, I want to, no, I want to tell you. Okay. <laughs> no, I can't tell you any more then. Okay. Because it feels like we're making good progress, right? No, you've, you've essentially done it. Okay. No. Woo! Psych! Okay. Okay, here. Here. Is it the save everyone's life like a boss ending? Kind of. Oh, nice. Okay. <laughs> Uh, swing, swing, swing. Okay, here we go. Oh, come on. And I need to figure out how to beat that thing? That tall, that big refrigerator monster thing? No. Wait, really? Yeah. Shoot. Is there a different way that I should have dealt with the refrigerator monster? You can tell me that. Um, you don't... That... You don't have to interact with that. So you spawn events depending on where you go. If you don't go certain places, those events don't happen. 
So had you not entered the kitchen, the hand monster wouldn't have appeared. Oh, really? Okay, okay, that's good to know. So I just kind of brought that on myself. Yeah. Why is everything, why does everything in this house have to eat you? <laughs> Maybe you should just hide from her. Oh, your sister sure is cute. You think you could put in a good word for her? Wait, does he not help me now? That's weird. Why is he not helping me anymore? Come on, man. What's up, bro? Okay, she's gonna go to the potty in a second, but I think we have time for this. Nope, damn it, I got too close. His, his reach is very, very long. He's got a very long extended mouth reach in defense of me. I just want to make sure they steps on it in time. I think we give it one more good run. One more good run, I agree. Okay, fine. All of these, th this has been a solid one. The, rarely do we have such sequences of solid progress on GT Live. I am very pleased with how we've been doing here. Okay, milk, pour, boop. This is, it's a very satisfying game uh, to see like everything kind of fit together and you like running the course of these different moments. It's actually very good. Ooh, okay, you're gone. So now I need bucket. Bucket. Boop -a -doo. I like that she just skips everywhere too. It's just very joyful. She reminds me a lot of uh, Mabel from Gravity Falls. Okay, one, two, three. So if I don't go into the kitchen, it doesn't spawn that. That's good to know. Okay, pick up, pick up. Let's get the shotgun. How am I gonna kill daddy? I feel like that's a big concern right now. Have you considered that maybe not killing daddy? You don't have to kill daddy. He, uh, no, because I, I did once and then he stabbed me in the eyeball. So, you know, fooled me once, stabbed me in the eyeball once, Shame on you. Stab me in the eyeball twice. Uh, shame on me for giving you a chance to hug me again. Huh. You just need to like... Okay, here's this. Boop. Good. Where's my bowling ball? Boop. Boop. Okay. Oh, jeez. Slipped on my own water. Okay, here we go. This is, this is, this is the final boss right here. No! God. Okay, great. Slingshot. Boop. No. Slingshot. Boop. So do I need this one then? If if you're alluding to me not having to kill daddy, then do I need any of that? Presumably not, right? These shotgun shells become extraneous. Hey, I made sandwiches. Fantastic. There's that. And the... Oh! What the heck is that? Why? What is this thing? What is this little caterpillar worm? We've been here before, haven't we? We have. Will you hold me? Yes. Uh, I'm just gonna, just gonna slowly walk away from that one. I don't want to touch that with a 10-foot pole. No thank you. Hate snails more than I hate father. Okay, cool. Here, let's hang out in your room. Cool, hey. Thanks for bringing her to me, Tabby. I missed you. Don't ever leave me again. Okay. So now what? Okay. All right. Um, my sister's better. So if, okay, so you're telling me don't go to the kitchen to spawn the thing. Don't, so I, I technically I'm, I'm, I'm done-ish. Maybe? Here, we'll see. Uh, another hint is that uh, certain events are time-coded. Yes. Uh, yeah, no, of course. When you get to a certain time at night, yes. certain things happen. Yeah. So maybe go hang out with your sister a little bit and just see what she does. Really? Okay. Is she going to... I missed you, Dolly. Don't ever leave me again. Okay. I, yeah, I, I mean, she does seem to be kind of the, the crux of the whole thing, so that makes sense. Just gonna hang out. I heard something suspicious happen outside. That was concerning. 
I'm just gonna just gonna hang out here with a shotgun. Don't mind me over here, sister. Just just hanging out with my shotgun. Just in case, you never know. You never know what's gonna happen. And my snail. Shotgun and a snail. <laughs> I'm at the ready. Okay, oh, okay, hey, hey, okay, oh no, oh no, where are you going, where are you going? What's, what's going on, hey, 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 okay, hey, oh. Where are we going? Where are we going, sis? Oh no, what is this, what is this? Are you doing some demonic ritual? The hills are alive. Wait, what? Daddy's home. He's playing Dockery. No! No, no. What? Your sister's song fills the house. The dark burns away as the sound echoes throughout. <gasps> Did I help her? Is she better? Is this it? Deep shadows retreat from your father's eyes. The curse lifts, but at what cost? N none, really. I don't think. <laughs> right? I'm not wrong to assume that there was no cost. Everyone survived. Hey! That was great! We did it! I'm glad that my, my sister is such a prodigious musician playing her ocarina of time here. So yay, we won. What about what about the dead body in in my mom and dad's room? What what happened to that? What what what's up with that one? The end question mark? I feel. Are we a happy family? <laughs> okay, there it is. So you think you've beaten it? Unclear. Skeptical. Well, I'm afraid you're terribly wrong. Okay, this is intense. There's no way to stop it. No matter how hard you and the snail try. So do I have to do it without the snail? Do I have to do it without the snail? I wonder. It never ends. I bet I have to do it without the snail. That's a clue. That's a, hey, you did it on easy mode. But there are other modes. Here, I, I'm assuming I got a diary entry out of this. I'm curious. Here, let's just hop into it and then we're going to wrap this episode up. Just because I want to see the diary entry. Because I'm assuming there's one that's telling me like... I did this, but this other thing didn't happen. Uh, maybe? Yeah, okay, the song. I remember when Father would hum that song to us before bed. It always put us at ease. It just hurts my ears now. So I'm kind of like, maybe a demon? Am I possessed by the... Am I dead? No. Huh. This is interesting. I love this game. This game is so fun and fascinating. Uh, okay, so we're going to save it there. But, um... Cool! Hey! That was a good-ish ending. It seems about as, as good as you would hope for. I mean, your mom and the rat died. Wait, my mom died? Yeah, you didn't save her. She ate the sandwich. Oh! I... Oh! So she's poisoning her own sandwich? Yeah. Oh, because when you said that certain events don't happen... Oh, I think she eats I, the sandwich regardless. And that, well, she no, she eats the sandwich regardless. But I didn't realize that. I thought that the bubbles over her head meant that she was like asleep or drunk or something. No, that's her. And and then I thought that her dying was the hand coming out and grabbing. Oh, so ma, so me and my sister and dad are alive, but my mom's. Dead. Oh, I gotta say, my mom. And the rat, the rat's alive because uh, the yeah. rat. Escapes oh, from the that's true. Okay. the the rat. I didn't kill the rat. I okay. didn't. I didn't kill him. Yeah. He escapes. For, like he's a hurt. Humane, a humane rat trap. I mean, humane. Uh, humane. <laughs> he's he escaped. You know. So and he still moved and bit off my head in an iteration of the game. So that counts. Okay. So it seems like there are more endings afoot. And I like this game. I hope you like this game. I think we got to find these endings. I think I think that's just the moral of the story, right? I think we try to figure out how to save mom. What happens if you kill them all? Can you kill them all? Anyway, huh, I bet I bet there's, so now that I know that there's multiple endings and stuff, I bet there's an ending where you can kill them all too. Oh, that relates to the, the toilet demon. The toilet demon tells me bad things. Yeah, okay, it's all come together. So anyway, we're gonna do at least one more part of this as we try to get whatever the final true ending is. 
Uh, and maybe we'll see some bad endings too. So outside of the ones that we've already gotten with, you know, my head being bitten off by a giant rat. No jokes on it. Anyway, uh, there you go, friends. Remember, uh, Game Theory uh, Halloween merch is available right below this video. And that's about it. So I will see you in the next one. And remember, it's all just a stream, a live stream. It wasn't a video. It was a video for you. I, I don't know. I, I need to really focus on the conclusion. I, I just fall into the catchphrases and I said the wrong one that time. I'm sorry. It wasn't a, it wasn't a live stream. It was a video, a video for you. See ya. Mm.